Hello, everybody. I'm Tom Vassell. I'm Chris Yee. I'm Mike Delicio. Today, we're playing a new game from Yellow called Ancient Knowledge. Each of us is playing an ancient civilization that is going to go through time. And in fact, in this game, time is your enemy, as is... Of us all. Mm. We all hate time. Art right? imitates life. We're much like David Bowie in that way. Mm. I'm, I assume it's a song reference that I'm not <laughs> catching. I'm really off on my music here. But I will tell you what I'm not off on is my civilization. These don't really have names, so I'm Egyptalasia. Oh, okay. Oh, I didn't know this. Oh, I'm no. not prepared, Tom. I'm not prepared to make up a fake civilization. I'm, I'm... a Baba Long John Silvers. <laughs> um, I'm Purpleopoly. <laughs> All right. Well, you could all vote on the best name of those. But anyhow, uh, where you all start it, and the game... So this game has preset hands of cards that you can start with. Mm -hmm. Or, since we've already played the game before this this one, you can draft ten and keep six. Yes. Chris, mm -hmm. Chris gave me terrible cards. Chris also shuffled. I'm not thrilled with my starting hand either. Chris is very happy. He's been he's been notably silent about how he feels about his starting hand of six oh, cards. Oh, that, that darn shuffler. Oof. Mm -hmm. What we're going to do in this game is we're going to kind of explain it to you as we play it. But I will mention what we're, what we're trying to do is we're trying to get points. There's a lot of cards. So this card here, for example, um, this from Myanmar, this card has four points on it. So that's one of the ways you're going to get points. And that card is only going to get me points if I it's a monument that I have over here at in the end past. of the game. In my, in my past. Uh, those will give me points. There's also technology cards that will give points. Like, for example, this one here is, at, at the end of the game, going to give me two points down here. So that's one of the main ways to get points. As we put out cards, they're going to give us knowledge. Knowledge is good if you use it. But if you don't use it, you've lost it. Like my dad said, use, use it, it or lose it. Lose it. <laughs> <laughs> and in this game... Losing it's bad because we're going to keep lost knowledge here on our boards, and that lost knowledge will be worth negative points at the end of the game. One to one, yeah. So here you go, Mike. Here's some negative ten. There's to start ten with. You're, you're gonna... negative knowledge. Tisk, tisk, well, tisk. Possibly that's going to happen. So on your turn, you have two actions, and I'm going to talk about some of the actions that you can play, and then I'll show you my actual real actions. Actually, I'm going to show you my one a real action here for sure is playing an artifact. So you can have five artifacts here in front of you, and you just play an artifact. It's kind of a free action to do, but you only have room for five, so you need to pick and choose them carefully. Artifacts often give you special abilities. So this one says, every time I learn, which is another action, I will draw two cards. In this game, you do not automatically draw cards. One of your actions can be draw a card, mm -hmm. but as the rule book says, that's a sucker action. Yep. There I've are done. other ways to draw cards I've we'll done show it. as well. I think that's the verbatim part of the rule book. Yeah. You're a sucker. So is that your actual first action? That time? is my you've actual first you've action. You created already. That is that is my a creation. Goodness. So when you create, there's three different things you can create. One of them is an artifact. The other three are going to be monuments, and there are three different types of monuments of which I. Uh, you can show your card that'll I show have that. Two in my hand. Let me show you the third one. Each monument and every monument in this game, as far as we can tell is unique, but they mm. all have a different type. That type is in the top Count corner. Those cards, see which one he swaps. Mm. The, one that, the one yeah, that is yeah. there now, like my hand. the one that is there now, and folks, this is a, uh, a blue screen here, so this is actually a green card. Yeah. All right. Um, and, well, it is, I promise. Mm -hmm. uh, then there's, this is the other kind, and this is the third kind. Each of these that cards, when you mm -hmm. play this card, it's going to show you what time number. So if you look above each person's board, you'll see there's one through six. That's the time number you have to put that above when you play the card. Each of these numbers may have two cards placed above them. Uh, no more, um, but, but less is fine. You may mm -hmm. also discard cards from your hand. So if I wanted to play this, I could discard a card to play it in the two, or I could discard a card to play it in the four. Maybe I want it a round longer, mm -hmm. or I want it a round shorter. Um, some cards have a discarding card as a requirement. So, for example, this one here says... Oh, that has two little thingies on it. That has yeah. four. This, has, this requires me to discard four cards to put right. this in play. And it has a lock on it, which means I may not discard more cards to move it. It has to start at six. Woo. But the benefit of this one here at the bottom says if I have 20 forgot knowledge here... I discard 15 of it. Yeah, and that's it's an, an amazing point card. Yeah. That's basically 15 points. Right. 
Yes, but it's very difficult to pull off, and I'm just telling you right now, folks, in this particular game, will not happen because it's in my opening hand. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and I'm not going to hold on to that for the whole game. <laughs> so, I already mentioned that you can draw a, uh, um, uh, draw a card as an action, and there's a way to draw more cards, and we'll show that when it happens. Sure. The last thing we can do, and this is, this is going to be my actual second action, is to take a technology. So there are two rows of level one technologies and one row of level two. Level two is all end game points. Level mm -hmm. one is all sorts of things. Many of them have prerequisites. Happily, the one I'm about to take does not. Okay. I wanted this one, which says, but it, this one needs one of each color monument in my past. I have no monuments in my past. Right. This has no prerequisite, so I'm going to take this card here, a technology card, and this lets me look at the top eight cards of the deck, take one, and discard the remaining cards. And Tom, I'm going to tell you right now, thank you for making that your second action rather than your first action because Chris will be able to go while you are looking through those cards. But right? The, yes, but the main reason I did that mm -hmm. is because every time I yes. use that learn, that's right. a learn action, yep. I'm also going to draw two cards. So I'm going to take one of those eight cards and then I'll draw two more cards. All right. Um, so let's pretend one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Those are the eight cards. I won't look at those. I draw. I, I finish my turn. I'm going to do that in a second. Then there's a timeline phase. Some cards will have timeline actions. A timeline action shows an icon on the card. Let me find one. That's this okay. one here. This one here says, if you have, see the little hammer symbol there? If I have two lost knowledge or less on your board and at least one monument in your past draw a card that's going to happen every turn yep. at the end of my turn all those will go off and you can trigger them in any order you like as well <laughs> then after we're done with that we're going to decline every monument that's up here is going to slide over one before they slide though the ones in one will like ah fall into your past in your past well that's good because you're going to get points from them mm -hmm. it's bad if there's still knowledge on them because that knowledge will go here and some cards will do something as they fall into your past. There's also monuments that will do things immediately. Then when I'm done declining, I say, Chris, it's your turn, and it's his turn. And did I get rid of that card? I did not. And we refill. No, I, not yet. I caught it's, myself. Uh, <coughs> we refill oh, we, technologies. We, we, only when one is only down to one. one That's right. Thank you. Thank Where you. I didn't my see that. Sixth card go, though. I don't know. You put two over there. You've been doing a lot of card stuff. <laughs> yeah, I know I did. Um, this is the issue of, uh, mm -hmm. of teaching while. Ah, here's the, here's the other one. Okay. Oh, okay. So. The, the green one is the one I did not have. I had to make sure it went out of my hand. All right. Okay, so I do that. So Chris is going to start going while I look through all my cards. I'm going to do a, a, a create action here. I'm going to create this one. It's going to go into the level two of my timeline. And that lightning bolt is an immediate effect, which I'm very excited about. You may create, as a free action, one of these artifacts. relic uh, artifacts. Or, is that, cards. Yeah. yeah. So I'm going to do this one here that says ongoing during the uh, the the timeline phase, that hammer symbol is going to let me draw a card if I'm down to zero or one cards in my hand. So that feels like a nice one, two combo. That's one action, folks. I'm all about the efficiencies. He's all about the efficiencies. About the and for efficiency. my second action, I'm going to demonstrate an inefficient action. I'm doing this for demonstration purposes mm -hmm. only. This is called the search action. I draw a card. All right, so that's the end of my... Uh, action phase, so now going to the timeline phase. Sorry, I built a, uh, a monument here mm -hmm. that has three knowledge on it, so I'm going to be trying to get rid of this knowledge before it falls off, because now it is the decline phase. I have one more round to get rid of this. We're going to scoochie scoochie these over yeah, just they can, go up, they can go up closer to me. Okay, we can do that too. There we go. Although, yeah, that'll, that'll work. All right. Yeah. Work. I, I finally have chosen be. my card. Mike. All right, so it's to me already. Wow, what do you know? What do you know? <laughs> so here's what we're going to do. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to create an artifact, Tom. And this is very similar to yours, isn't it? Each time. One you showed, yeah. I wish I had that one, Each Mike. time you learn one of the feather uh, technologies, yeah. then you'll draw two cards. So probably no shock to you as to what my second action is going to be, is I am going to learn one of those feather technologies because I would like to draw more cards. More cards are good. So now, I've got a couple of options here. So heads up, you might have noticed, folks, that there is a missing card here because I took it. Yep. It does not refill. But if Mike took this card, for example, mm -hmm. now there's only one card left, then we're going to discard and refill it. Yeah, and I considered that. This is one that may, would make both of you discard a card from your hand, but... 
I'm much more interested in the possibility of getting a free creation uh, out of this. So I'm going to draw the top 10 cards of my deck. I'm going to choose and create one artifact. Hopefully there's an artifact in there. And then I will discard the uh, remaining card. So I'm taking a bit of a risk here. But the other thing that I'm doing is I'm immediately going to be drawing two cards because I am learning one of those feather. Thank you. This is the card one Mike One of those took. feather cards, right? Draw the top ten though. cards. Right. This is garbage, Mike. No, I think this is fantastic, Tom. I think Mike has uh, better versions of every card you have, Tom. <laughs> it's starting to feel that way. Now, the other thing is that there is a hand limit of 10, correct, Tom? That is correct. All right, so this will not take me above my 10, uh, because I drew two for that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep, so um, if you want, Tom, you can go ahead and go. I'm going to be hoping that there is a there is a small possibility that the card I draw could affect things, but I don't think so. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I drew ten, Tom. Yeah, here's the thing. You you're gonna discard every one of those that's not an artifact. That's because correct. That, that's the only those are the only ones you care about. So these are the only two that are even in consideration. And I will play this one. Tom, thank you. Now my green artifacts come into play with one knowledge oh, less for the rest of the game. Wow. That's good, Mike. All right. That's good. Hey, I'm Egypt. Uh, Malaysia. Why yeah, but uh, I'm visiting so Khufu, Tom. You yeah. took my barge! What happens in Khufu stays in Khufu. And then because you played that card, now you draw two more. Thanks oh, to my goodness. Technology, right? No, no, that's only when I... Oh, when no, I, thanks to your other artifact. You're right. No, no, this is when you learn a thing, you draw two. Yeah, that artifact affects... This. This. But you just did that. Around. I, but I already drew those two cards. Oh, you already drew those I two did, cards. yes. Oh, yes, okay. Yes. That's fine. Tom, I've never seen someone try to cheat on behalf right. of Right. I mean, I'll draw more if you want me to. I shall play another <laughs> artifact, which says whenever I create a blue, I draw a card. That's my action one. What is a second action? Card? Right. If there's anything I learned from my first game, it's make sure you know how to draw cards. Because I was sitting there with zero cards, and Mike and, mm -hmm. and uh, Chris were having lots of fun. But um, this one I'm going to play because this one is worth no points. And I have to discard two cards to play it. However... At the end of the game, it's going to give me a point for every other blue in my pass. Well, for each. So it's, I guess it's worth one point minimum. Mm -hmm. This is going to start on five. I need to discard two cards. I don't know that I care that it starts on five. I don't want to make it start sooner or later. So I will discard one. Hey, Tom, we're early in the game, and i got to imagine there are people that are saying, two, three. but how does the game end? Well, if you look uh, on oh, our sorry. card, it's so, yeah, on the card the here. Fives. Throw that up there. End of the game is at the very bottom of the card. When when one player gets their 14th card or more into the t past, that's going to trigger the end game. Tom was the first player. We'll have equal number of turns. So that's the end game. And Tom has this uh, beautiful turducken uh, first Yeah, some type of a, of a birdie bird. And since I, I played a, a blue card, I draw a card. Oh, okay. my goodness. That was exciting. I think Tom's um, and then... Nothing. So, bu 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 All right. Decline there is the one more action we did not mention. You may discard on your turn as many cards as you'd like. And yep. for each card you discard, you can take a knowledge off, off of any of cards these in your cards. timeline. That's desperation. But mm -hmm. you're going to probably want to do it occasionally yeah. because there are lots of cards and ways to get these off. But yeah. the easiest way is to discard cards from your hand. And there is one other action, but we're not going to show it until we get cards in our past. That's correct. <laughs> I'll be showing that off here soon. Will okay. You? I, I will. So, well, uh, one of the things to note is, on my turn now, I could discard three cards. I considered it to get rid of this knowledge, because I don't want to lose points. Mm -hmm. But, it's not the worst thing in the world to lose a few points here and there. It There's, isn't. The rulebook yeah. tells you that, too, because sometimes requirements for cards require right. lost knowledge. <clears throat> and there are ways, like you saw that one card that let you get rid of 15 of them, which yeah. I if you uh, had 20 of it. I uh, have not yet discarded, but probably still will. All right, so my turn. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to play this artifact. When uh, when I play orange monuments, they come out with one fewer mm -hmm. knowledge token on it. You know what? I would like to get one of those. Could you deal me one? Because Mike has one and you have one, and I feel, I'm feeling mm. a, little, a little, little left out. You should. A little left out, huh? Um, Ooh, that's intriguing. And then for my second action, I'm going to go ahead and Tis play this intriguing. one, which requires me to discard a card. <sighs> I sure would like to be down another card, but uh, this is going to come out here onto six with two knowledge on it. Oh, actually, you know what? Why don't you show off this symbol here, Tom? I like to see you make this it. is okay, this is a new one. It's <laughs> going to start on my six, 
uh, section of the timeline, but that symbol there on the on the right of that green bar says that when this expires, when this goes into your past during the decline phase, that's when I can activate learn up to the two symbol right here. Yep, that's the one. So that's right. going to let me do technologies in a few rounds. I'm investing in the future. The the, the that card also has a Teotihuacan. lock symbol on it, which means Chris could not put it lower if he wanted to. Mm -hmm. Teotihuacan. Happy that I got that. Mm. Yes, I don't have to say it this time. <laughs> uh, timeline phase. I unfortunately don't have zero one card, so I can't activate this. Nothing else is timeline phase. So this is going to fall oh, forward. Oh, oh, oh. I believe we're winning by default. Here, we Mike. are. That's we're up three points on Chris. Okay, and Not then two because that card itself is worth. Oh, a point. that's true. That's a good point, Tom. So Chris is at negative two right negative now. Negative two. Look, sometimes you gotta. And we're gonna have to call the game here. That's it. We Tom, I'll take a tie. <laughs> you gotta spend knowledge mm -hmm. to lose knowledge. That's another famous saying. That's what my dad always told me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. That explains it a bit. <laughs> well, uh, my green monuments come into play uh, with one fewer knowledge on them, so I'm going to play this one. This gonna, I'm going to be putting three knowledge on it instead of four. When I learn, I can reduce uh, one of the values of the technology. Oh, the I haven't seen one. this card yet. This is amazing. Yeah, so it makes these cards easier to get because it lowers their requirements. Okay, I so that it. has so to much. go into four. I'll be putting three knowledge on instead of four. Because of this card, and because that's a monument, that ability is active until it falls. Until it out falls, of your yes, exactly right. Um, now it doesn't really help me here all that much, uh, but folks, I'm sorry, I, I'm not doing this just to be mean. I'm doing it because I want to draw cards, uh, and I can't play this one, so I am going to play Cretan uh, hieroglyphs, Tom. So you folks, unfortunately, are going to have to discard one you know card what? from your hand. I swore I was going to discard this card. Get out. All right, so I'm drawing. I'm doing that because I want to play. I want to draw two Put more cards. Put it in cards. here. We we uh, are keeping a record of it. We are indeed. And <laughs> also, I will. I wanted out of the kindness of my heart, Tom. I wanted to give you access to two more cards uh, because you'll be doing that here in just a moment. Right. That's true. This will wipe. Right. No, so it happens right away. Well, this will go away. Yep. And then we'll refill this. Refill this, and one, there's going to be some nice juicy cards two, here, Tom. I don't want to hear it. Three. Yeah. Those are actually pretty good. They are good. Ooh. They're great. Actually, that, this one's great for you. Okay, so I've taken my two actions. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in my timeline phase. I have no cards that activate during the time flat, timeline phase. My decline, this moves to three. All right, that's it. Hmm. 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 <laughs> hmm. Okay. Well, the problem that I have is that Mike... Made me, <laughs> Mike. Mike, you messed me over tremendously. I'm so sorry. One. You can draw a card. I don't believe you're even a little sorry. No, I, I, um, I look. I did that solely to get more cards, not to mess with all you. Right. We believe you. We believe. I don't know if I want to do the action of taking a card, but I might. Okay, I'm going to do it just because. So I'm going to draw one card. This better not be a good card. I'm not going to even look at it. Don't even I'm look at it. I'm going to discard three cards to play this one. Oh, my. Which is when it eventually it goes into decline, oh. I can learn a technology without fulfilling the requirements. That's so, nice. Yeah, but it's going to be a while before that gets there. However, that was a blue card, which lets me draw a card. So, oh, oh, oh my. This is so against Mike, it actually has your name on here. Tom, This you can do this right away, can't you, during the timeline phase? No, that's because it's a decline symbol. Oh, it's a decline symbol. That's Thank when you. it You're falls right. off. Yeah, when it falls off. Oh, if I could do that every phase. Yeah, that'd no, be that'd amazing. be crazy, right? However, right. Do, 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 do. All right. Tom is really excited about that card. He is, yeah. And I'm excited for him to be excited about that card because he did not say this will affect Chris. No. Uh, I'm gonna oh, the one I drew? Yeah. Oh, yeah, no, don't worry about it. You're fine. <laughs> well, you're fine for now. Mm -hmm. yeah. I'm going to do the, the last, or no, no, sorry. I'm going to do one of the last actions we haven't seen yet. This is the excavate action. Okay. Really? Yeah, so I'm going to tap one of these cards in my timeline. It is now rotated, mm -hmm. uh, but what it's going to allow me to do is draw two cards. Yep. Because I am in need of cards. Ah, well, I, <clears throat> I wonder why. But here's the thing. You only discarded one. The cool thing about that action is, see, the, the reason I surprised Chris did that is because if you have multiple cards, you can tap them all to draw. Yeah. So you can save yourself. Like, if you have three cards, right. you get six cards. Right, 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 right. Yeah. So I mean, Chris it's definitely... is effectively wasting time. But again, it's Mike's fault. 
It is my fault. <laughs> let's be clear about that. All right, let's do this. I'm excited about this. I'm less excited. I'm going to go ahead and play this one as my second action, so I'm creating, and I am going to discard two cards to move it from the fourth column down to the second. Uh, this says, swap this monument with another monument in your timeline. I feel like you're doing some tricksy stuff. I am. Oops, so you, sorry about elbows. So you move that at two, problem. and then when you put it out, you're swapping it with that very cool one. Yep. Zoop. That's nice. Also, oh. this comes out with one less knowledge on it, i.e. zero knowledge. So I'm excited about this. Uh, now it's my decline phase. Zoop, zoop, zap. Oh, sorry, sorry. Before my decline phase, the timeline phase, I yep. have zero one cards. There you go. Draw a card. Now it's uh, Now decline. zoop, zoop, zap happens. Now, yeah. You can't zoop, zoop, zap before it's time. Zoopity, right? doobity, zoopity, zoopity, Never zoop, 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 zoop when it's time for the <laughs> flip flop. Yeah, yeah. Zoopity, 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 zap, zoopity. Bop, 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 boop. All right, so it's to me, correct? It is to me. You know that song, I always wondered, did they write the lyrics out for it? They must have, because they all said the same thing. Yeah. Yeah. I, who was that? Not the Backstreet Boys. Uh, Phil, it was Phil Collins. No, 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 but the, <laughs> the group joined him. The, uh, one of the boy bands sang it with him in uh, Over the Credits. Which mm. movie is this? This is Tarzan. Oh, my. Okay. I know 98 Degrees sang with Stevie Wonder on at the end of Mulan. I'm going to create this, Tom. Oh. Uh, this is a card that Chris had in the last game, which is terrific. So that action you just saw him do where he rotated or tapped a card to draw two cards. Now, for the rest of the game... When I tap, I'm going to be drawing three. It's a good card so to have early in the game. you're going to occasionally run across broken combos. <laughs> <laughs> this is a really good card to get early in the game like this. That so that's my first me. action. My second action is going to be to play uh, above here, unfortunately. Sorry. Um, oh, wow, this okay. card, all right, which uh, I have to place two now. Uh, I have to see. Like, I'm sorry. Thank you. Two knowledge. Well, just let you play another blue. It lets me play another blue, yeah. Yep. Well, how convenient. So I'll put the two knowledge on there. And then, uh, uh, that was really dumb, Mike. <laughs> um, well, uh, what I, I meant to play this one first, because that one would come with one less. Yeah, but then that one won't let you play the other one. You're right. So it doesn't matter. Okay. So I'll put two on here. Thank you. I'm sorry. Oh, this is one of those things I wish I could have seen in real life. Although you can see something close to that in the British Historical Museum. Mm-hmm. So my other blue monuments are going to come in with uh, one knowledge less, but you're right, I couldn't have played that one on this turn with this as well. All right, so looking across here, I've got none of the cards that activate during the timeline phase, so simply these are going to be moving down and moving down. I need to start getting rid All of All right, that for my stuff. first action, I'm going to take a tech. This tech, which Chris could have, instead of doing his weird thing, he could have just done this, which moves a monument in your timeline to any other space. So I'm going to take this one and go all the way down to number one. I was really hoping to get that one, Thomas. I was really worried you were going to take it last turn. <laughs> I was very nervous about this. All right, then this goes away, bringing Wait, in... Wait, does it go away, or yes, do we just add to it? because it was down one. Nope, it oh, didn't go away. Okay. I double-checked to make thank sure. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And then for my second action, I cannot play this. Am I drawing a card again? I could take another tech, I think. I probably should. Discard one from each. Oh, well then, yes. I Darn should it. take this one, that which lets me discard one knowledge from each of the blue cards in my oh, timeline. Thanks. So you're at two and two on those, right? I am. Now my time is over. Okay, but the good news is when this one falls in here, I may learn a technology without fulfilling the requirements. Woo! My goodness. So you're probably looking at one of those juicy. Draw three cards, two probably. Cards. Oh, you're right. Or I could just take some points. Just take some points, right? I mean, that's four points right there. Yeah, you have that interesting choice. It's early in the game. It is early in the game. But also, four points is four it points. It's four points. But also three cards. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're, but you're going to have access to that in two turns, Tom. You're going to have more blue than the rest of us. Huh? You're going to have access to that card in two turns. The requirement's two blues in, in, in your, your past. past. And you're going to beat both of us to that unless... We have, yeah, unless we have, like, ones that we can That's play. the thing, though, right? I, I you don't know like, what I got, Tom. You don't know yeah. what I got. You know what? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do a suboptimal action here. Do it. I'm going to do this one. Even though I could have done it... I have the requirement. You zero just to one lost card. the game. But it's because Chris could take it on his turn, and he might have. Um, but also, when I take this, I draw three cards. But also, when I do a blue, I draw two cards. Oh, my goodness. So, Oof. That's not as 
end game -y, but I want my cards. That's what you call uh, ancient knowledge, folks. That's right uh, there. You just saw some ancient knowledge. What happened there, Mike, is that was all precipitated by you making me discard <laughs> that card. Really? One card all this time? Later on, when I stand over the graves of your grandchildren. You hurt me. <laughs> I guess. You you punched Tom and went right past his head and, and nipped my shoulder. I missed shoulder. him and, and I, and I yeah. All right, sorry. over to you, Chris. All right. So one of the things... By the way, that I'll show people what I took while Chris is deciding. This is the... I got a... Uh, that's a uh, Ptolemy. Ptolemy, yeah. The, I, the I blue technology gets from that. busts. I, I, I'm pretty sure the P is silent. It's like pterodactyl. Yeah. Um, Which, if you spell correctly, you get to go and be win a spelling bee in the nation. That was uh, an Aquila and a B. Ooh, was that the is, word? That was uh, the first one that she spelled in her school spelling bee. Great oh. movie, by the way. Aquila and the B. I never watched that one, actually. I don't think I did either, yeah. It's, it's a very good movie. I think I'm going to take a technology just to kind of be able to wipe this and see yeah, see what new stuff's coming out. So I'm going to take the runic alphabet, okay. which allows me to straighten two rotated monuments in my past. That's Unfortunately, nice. it's only one, but I'm happy with it still. So this is going to reveal a new lineup here. Ooh, almost. Choose a monument in your time with at least five. Ooh. Ah, darn. I don't have that. I think for my second action, I'm, I'm, now I'm getting a little bit nervous here. Um, <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and rotate this to. No, 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 because. Yes, I yes, yes, yes. Do this. <laughs> I'm going to play this one out here onto my four. Is that in screen? Good enough. All right. Yeah, I'm playing this one out. It's got four knowledge on it. Bam, 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 bam. Now I can do my uh, timeline actions. So I'm going to be able to draw a card. Zoop. Sweet. And now it's decay time. This is what Chris just took. He played Moron. <laughs> Moron, it says. So this is interesting because if he gets a lot of blues... At the end of the game, this is worth no points, but it could be worth four or seven. Sure. Yeah. Yeah, I would have really ahead. liked and got that since I'm already working on my second blue. This is Chris's first blue, which I feel like is a waste. I feel like this whole card is just a, a waste. Absolutely. Those are blue. It's, it's for blue monuments he's working for. For blue monuments. Got it. Yeah. Okay. 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 So the decline phase, these are going to come down here. I've got five. Negative points, unfortunately. Folks, we're calling them blue, but they're, the blue ones are megaliths. Okay. The green oh. ones are pyramids, and the orange ones are cities. Okay. Got and then, it. Yeah, yeah. And then artifacts are the purples, yeah. So as this declines here, I can learn up to two technologies if I fulfill the requirements. Uh, first, I'm going to choose uh, one monument in each opponent's timeline and add one knowledge to it, plus I get to draw a card. Uh, see, uh, that's uh, pretty terrible. Uh, last year I was discarding so yeah, a card at that, at that point in time. Um, uh, I'm going to go ahead and do your your green one up there on the front. Okay. So I drew a card from that, and now uh, I almost had that. Here's what Chris used: ancient Hebrew to attack both of us with. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's the most violent of all languages. He did not write shalom. That's <laughs> right. For sure. not, not at all. <laughs> Ooh, Hermes Trismegistus. You're gonna like this. Everybody's gonna like this. So. Oh yeah, this is okay. This, I applaud you. This, this so takes away his negative thing he did to us. It, it, it kind of does, but not really. I still think it was a, a negative, a net negative. Reveal the top five cards. I get to choose one. Everyone chooses one, and then uh, we, I get to choose one extra one there at the mm -hmm. end. Mm -hmm. I'm definitely gonna take the blue one for some weird, mysterious reason. Oh, then I don't mm -hmm. even care what I get anymore. Thanks a lot, Chris. I will take. This one. Each time you learn one blue, discard one Not knowledge from any non monument, and then draw a card. Oh, I'm sure someone's Not pointing this thing. out. I, I, we we misread this really quick. Um, my moron. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure how to pronounce that. Uh, my my moron megalith here says that this is for number of blue. It's those techs. Yeah, that's why I was curious. I didn't think it was for. Oh, you're right. It is for techs. Yeah. Still feel like that was uh, pointed mm -hmm, at me. Okay, mm -hmm. you know what though? This card is almost the same thing. I shall take it. All right. And then I'm going to go ahead and take this orange. And this gets discarded. Look at that. I went from zero cards up to four. Uh, and then these have to decline. I finished the decline phase. Mike, you're up. All right. Well, 
it seems clear to me that I have three artifacts on my board. It would be, I think it would be silly for me not to go ahead and take this card right now to draw three more cards. Cards are always good in that this game. That seems super silly to me. One. Oops. Sorry. Two. That's, but you did make this more options for me. Three. Okay. Oh. I was hoping, Ooh. I was hoping that a leafy leaf card would come up that I can, add, that I can. We'll show the card Mike just took. Yep. Nope, that's oh, not that's the not the one I just took. But remember when Mike played that? I remember. I took this one. <laughs> Pepperidge Farm remembers. <laughs> Pepperidge Farm remembers. This is the one Mike just took. He yeah. took. I'm not even going to try to pronounce this guy's name. It's, I can't, is it? Anaxa means. Okay. I don't know why I said Anaxa I wasn't going to try, then I immediately tried. Let's see here, yeah. What you're telling me is you're a liar. Anaxa I'm I a would trier. Say. Anaxa means. All right, so that I'm was my joker. first. I'm, a <laughs> <laughs> I'm an all around stoker. <laughs> Wow. Say so you don't make your music references, Tom. Wow. Poo poo on them. Poo poo, indeed. All right. Um, yeah, still have some time to get rid of some of those. I wish I had a little more time to get rid of some of those. I'll tell you that right now. Um, For those watching at home, if you can use a stopwatch to see. Oh please, <laughs> please. <laughs> All right. I'm going to be playing this one right here. I'm going to be playing Chichen Itza, Tom. Ah, oh, ah! Oh, this is one of the few that I had a chance to see, but didn't. and this is coming in with one knowledge instead of two because of one of my relics, and it's going to allow me to discard one from here. Now, let's actually put this here so I can show people how That's right, adjacency, adjacency works. Adjacency matters. Right. So this is coming in with one. Remember, because of my relic here, this card is a is a monolith that is adjacent. Unfortunately for me, this card is not. If I think it were more forward planning, if Mike. it were reversed like this, let's just say that. You know what? Let's just play it like that, shall we? No, let's not. For education oh, okay. purposes. For educational sure, purposes. Mike. No, I can't. So, unfortunately, if that were the case, I could have removed one from there, but I can't. I can remove one from there. So, that's the way that goes. I don't have... St I, uh, actually, I do, right? Yes. Oh, wait a minute. That shouldn't have happened right away. Let me put it back How on there. Know, Oops. Mike? I'm going to make sure I'm doing this in the correct How order of operations. Would I know? Because this is actually going to allow me to take the second one off there. So, timeline phase, Got it. activate this card. So, I'm going to be able to get rid of both of those. That goes away. Then, everything slides down. So, that's even a better card than I initially thought. That is, because it's going to It's going to get rid of that one, too. So. All right, folks. I can't help myself. I always play these cards when I play this game. Uh, the, are, are you going for a shoot the moon card, Tom? I am. I love these cards. So, this is a card that's. Seven points, but Machu it comes Pichu. with seven knowledge on it. And when it goes into decline, if it has at least one knowledge, you discard it. So, so it's, it's all or nothing. You either it's have all or nothing. Seven so points I'm putting or it nothing. on three, and then I'm putting seven knowledge on it, which is a lot. Now, now you happily, could. there's a free technology out here that says choose a monument in your timeline with at least five, which mm -hmm. is this one, mm -hmm. and then I can discard three from that. So it's now down to four. So it's a little easier. It is. The other thing Tom could have done if he was really going for ancient knowledge is he could have discarded a couple cards to make it last longer in his timeline, making it more you know likely for him to get rid of those. But he's showing you a suboptimal play. He's done that a few turns in a row. It's I, I applaud him actually. <laughs> um, also, uh, shut up. <laughs> Go ahead, Chris. <laughs> All right. My clever comebacks <laughs> are spoken of in ancient halls. Mm. Yes, I've got I got six do that six bad knowledge sitting right there though, Tom. So, so now I'm, you might be thinking, folks, this is going to take forever because so far there's only three cards in, but Mike has four cards heading that way. Yeah, yeah, way. yeah. I have two in the uh, in the hopper here. You know what? Speaking of, I'm going to tap both of these. Wait, how did you untap the one? Was yeah, he, he had a technology it? that let him do oh, it. I yeah, but I despise everything about your culture. Mm-hmm. Sorry. Oh, wow. Look. <laughs> hey, why well, did say we were a good ancient wow. civilization? <laughs> Babylon John Silvers will not stand for this. Prepare for war. We're going to salt your lands. Mm. We're hey, gonna... General Sherman. I'm going to draw four oh, cards. That was, uh, who salted? it? That was um, Han Hannibal versus, who Who defeated Hannibal? Um, oh, uh, 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 don't put me on the spot like that, Tom. Anyway, the Rome Hannibal salted. Hannibal and his war elephants, yeah. yeah. Rome salted Carthage to the yeah. ground. Sure. I mean, also, wasn't that uh, Sherman in the Civil War? I don't know. Did he use salt? I know he just went through and, and did a wide swath of destruction. There was also Peabody yeah. in Sherman. Yeah, that's the one I'm thinking of. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so that was one action down. Uh, second action. Ooh. Ooh. I'm playing this one. This is 
Tom, you pronounce it. Thanks. Got it. This is the uh, Inkahuasi Quip. Oh, those are those are kipus. I, I know what kipus are. Those are oh, that's the, the those are the knotted strings. That was how the um, the Peruvians would use. It was like their version of the alphabet. That like that was the way they had their written language was with those kipu. Yeah. So, so the strings is, you would have three knots. or less on your board and at least one monument pastoral card. But you don't have three or less. I don't yet. Wait, I feel like something's going to happen. I feel like it is. I probably should have played this next turn, but <laughs> those are my two actions. Decline phase. I was just really excited about having the Kipu. Yeah. I like this ability a lot. Mike, you're up. The Kipu are, are cool. I, I, I enjoyed teaching about the Kipu. All right. Um, oh, oh, that's, a, that's a not a bad card because I'm going to be having some of those in my past. I know that much. All right, so let's go ahead and play this. I have to discard uh, a card to do so, Tom. I right now have two green, I have two pyramids that are going to be in my path, so I know this card is going to be worth at least three points. Um, so that's, you know, something to play for later, but I do have to discard a card to do it. Um, this is going to come in with two knowledge on it, and... And this is important because, folks, near the end of the game, any cards that do not fall into your pass don't score you points. Right. I think you Unless might get you, one point for each one. There are some point. cards that allow you, that'll say, gain a point for every card in your timeline. So sometimes you don't mind having those out there. All right. Uh, so that was my first action. Oy, uh, I don't love having all those there. You have a ton of cards in your hand. I do have a ton use of cards. Use them or lose them. I could. I could. Um, but I think instead what I'm going to do... Look, you, you, sometimes you're going to have negative points. Sometimes that's just the way it's going to be. Um, I can't play any of those. Can't play any of those. Okay. Let's go ahead and... Woo! No, we're not doing that one. We are... Um, yeah, we'll do this. We'll do this. This is coming in with three knowledge. Sorry. That's an end game card. If I, that's exactly what I was talking about. So at the end of the game, if I have three monuments in my timeline, I'm going to get six more points for we it. We will do everything we can to make that not happen. I'm sure you will. That's, that's, the, way, that's the way you uh, your civilization rolls, Tom. All right. Then we're going to look at the I'm, timeline not phase. Wrong. I know. We're going to look at the timeline phase. Discard one knowledge from each monolith adjacent. So now that one's good. And then... Ugh. Oh no! Yeah, I know. Oh no! Sometimes you have to deal. Oh no! 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 With negative knowledge. Actually, I'll trade all these in for a, a gold, gold fiber. A gold fiber. These come down, but now you know I can tap them later on. And every time I tap, remember I'm getting three cards instead of two. Boom, boom, boom. You had that early, and it felt like nothing. But right. it's going to start feeling right really now. Impactful. This is six cards if I if I want to. So you I'm going to play this giant's tomb. I don't know if this is a good card to play or not, but it can't hurt. So this just says at the end of the game, if I have twenty bad knowledge okay. here, I get twelve hey, points. That's that's yeah. That's it might work out right. It might. And it's it's uh, it only has one knowledge on it. It's coming in at five. You I don't really care. A card. I and I am discarding a card to do okay. that. Okay. I then, for my second action, am going to dis. Oh, and I oh I draw two cards for playing a blue. Mm. Yes. Oh, sorry. This should have come in with one less knowledge, right? Because of this. Okay. All right. I'm then going to discard four cards and get rid of all that. Wow. Nicely done. That is that is good. And then. Oh no! So. I got five there. An another card has come in, but this is worth a point for every blue in my pass, mm -hmm. so it's now worth two points. And chugga chugga chugga. And chugga chugga choo choo chugga chugga choo choo. I am finished. It is cute to me that you keep like ugh, knocking these over and then writing them. And then yeah, writing them. Yeah, because as they fall in, matters. I'm like, yeah, oh, that's right. Like, they can't lay down. <laughs> very much matters. Yes. All right. Well, I'm excited that I wanted to build. Um, yeah, well, don't try to read it in Whoops. my first action. Next turn, I need some cards. Yeah, right. I, just like I know what your action is going to be on your next turn. Well, no, it's not because Chris is going to take it. I knew. Oh, absolutely. I knew that was never going to what last. What is that one? Uh, if I have five lost knowledge on my board, discard three. We all had that. I'm like, there's no way it's coming to me because that also would give me two cards. Oh, I want knowledge in my. I, you I'm do. I'm using I, the giant's I don't. tomb. I am burying people right and left. Mm-hmm. People. 
I mean, uh, mm. we're kind of Egyptians. <laughs> so mm. when I die, everyone... Do you, do you know a lot about science? Yes. In the tomb! Right. <laughs> right. I, I go around and I'm like... People pretend they're stupid in my tests. Mm -hmm. Like, tell me, tell me about you know. And they're like, oh, I'm like, okay, well, then this guy's not coming to my tomb. It's fantastic. I am not visiting. What was your country again? I'm not visiting anytime soon. This is the one I want to build. You're not here. allowed. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I already told you what we thought of y'all. Right. We thought of y'all. And I'm going to discard this we're, one to pay for that. Southern Egyptian. That's right. Um, Walk like oh. an Egyptian. <laughs> Palenque. This is one much like uh, the earlier Moron that I played, where mm -hmm. this is going to be worth points for the number of feather technologies I've got. Ah, uh, well, that makes sense for you then, sure. Oh, yeah. Now you took one that matters. I know. You could have taken the one that... Okay. Mm. All right. There we go. Uh, oh, sorry, sorry. Before I do that, i got to activate this. I have three or fewer... Or three or less uh, lost knowledge, so I get to draw a card. Where, where, which one is that one? That's oh, that's the, a that's new one, not this one. Okay, the Correct. Kipu. That's a good one. That Kipu is good. I am the keeper of the Kipu. Not going to lie. Decline, and now Mike, you're up. Okie dokie. Well, then I think what I'm going to do, since I kind of knew that that wasn't going to last the, to get rid of that, I'm going to instead play the uh, Ishibutai Kofun. Um, By the way. Realize for folks watching, we we. I'm not. Yeah, I'm trying my best. Don't know every other language in the yeah, world. So. Yeah, this is Japanese. Oh, that's bad lighting. Let's see. Yeah, oh, there, there we go. go. Oh, this is go. basically during my timeline phase while it's on the board, which oh, is at least four awesome. turns. Yeah, that's nice. It, it allows me to at least get rid of a couple of these, right? I'm surprised that you can discard good. a card to make it last longer. No, because it's only, you know, if I leave these yeah. on, yeah. No, it'll be. I think it'll work out just about ah. right. I think it'll work out just about right. So this is going to put three knowledge on there. Boom, boom, boom. I got that. Boom, boom, boom. All right. Uh, so that's that. That doesn't trigger anything else here. Uh, I cannot, unfortunately, play any of those yet, right? I cannot. Although, wait, do I have... Oh, I thought I had a thing that let me do one less... Oh, this is only when it's on my board, right? Yeah. This isn't like... In my past, correct? This is no longer available to me, this power? That's correct. Yeah. yeah. Everything in the past is, is wiped. Oh, yep, exactly. Okay, so that came in with one last. I already did that. All right, so that was my first action. Do I want to? Yeah, I'll leave those on there. I will leave those on there. Wait, that whole, that whole thing was just one action? Yeah. <laughs> yes. That's and then uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's do that. I'm going to rotate one of these to draw three cards. Two mm -hmm. and three, and then mm -hmm. we're gonna do our timeliney timeliney stuff. If you have at least five on your board, discard one. I do, and then that is it. Oh, uh, discard one. Oh, that already took care of that one. Okay, these come here, and now I've got four cards in my past. I'm gonna do this. You gotta keep your past in the behind. Pretty, pretty cool, Mike. Rafiki. Yeah, yeah, and then these all move down. Boop. That one was tapped, wasn't Boop. it? Boop. Which one was tapped? Yes, one of these was tapped. The blue one was tapped. Thank you. I did not intentionally cheat, only All right. accidentally cheat. Action one for me. I'm going to draw four cards by whatever the action's called. Ooh. Now, I think it doesn't Ooh. matter which ones are tapped. It's basically just a count. Just a, yeah, nothing, it's a count. Nothing has any... Uh, power or, or value, basically, when it's in the past, right. except for the end game scoring ones. Got it. I'm going to play for my second action this blue card, which cost it cost me to discard a card, so I should do that. This if I this card, which is a giant statue of something, it looks pretty Ooh. cool. It's, it's a from, megalith. It's from Indonesia. Sul Sulawesi megalith. If I have at least seven blues in my past, it's worth six extra points. Oh wow! Points. Well, well, you've got three. I got, I got four. Four coming. now, yeah, yeah. So it may or may not work, but it's worth trying. It I had to discard a card trying. to play it. Uh, those are my two actions. So now, it worked! <laughs> Woo! And then these slide over. I don't have any like cool things I'm doing it for during each phase. So well, that's that's. Well, that's just the way my life works. All right, that's. Your oh, and I build a blue card. That, draw one card. That I like. All right. Oh. <gasps> 
Mike, your name is also on this card. Why? I discarded the other card. Why? Uh, All right, so folks, I'm going to show you a card. <laughs> no. I, at this point, Chris has hurt us more than I did. Thank you very much. Right. Chris you is mostly hurting me by taking stuff I want. Well, that's all right. Do he you, did something. Do you want mummification? Yes. I'm taking it. All right. So I almost took it last turn. Would that? Mm. Would you have been annoyed had I taken it? I uh, I forgot to read this one until just was now. that up there? Yeah. Discard as many. Oh my gosh. Uh, active knowledge yeah. as you have. Uh, so you get rid of three. Yeah. Actually, no. Why I didn't take it? Because I'm gonna make this card work if I have twenty. That's right. <laughs> yeah, that's true. So clearing three off is huge. That, feels that is nice. Very good. That is nice. Ooh, I like Aristotle. But there's another one. You can just get rid of two more from your... You can get rid of two of your negative knowledge. Ooh. They're all good, Chris. Freddie Mercury is... is that's quite tempting. Um, Mama. Ooh. Oh, my gosh. Oof. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. One, that's really disappointing. Let me show two. you on Freddie Mercury. All right. Freddie Mercury, the fastest... Fastest of all the gods. Mm-hmm. That's uh, that's the first Flash. What's his name? Gary. Uh, not, <laughs> first Flash. Yeah, with a with a sweet sweet winged helmet. Well, how do you keep your identity secret? I wiggle my face really fast. <laughs> <laughs> Is that like an actual thing? That was absolutely original Flash lore. Yeah. Wow. I can't remember what the what the name of him was. Uh, okay. So oh, sorry. Barry Allen. No, he's the he was so the more modern. Flash. Time timeline activations first. I have this one here. Uh, less than three lost knowledge, so I get to draw. Now, decline. Zoop, zoop. Chris and Mike have four cards in their decline, which doesn't mean anything because they still need ten more. But, mm -hmm. but, here's what you don't know, folks, is when, is it seven? Seven. Seven cards. Yes. Go We're going to flip one of these one boards to a two board, which just means more end game technologies come into play. Right. Didn't mean to make was that your uh, was that your turn, Chris? Yeah, I'm done. Christopher. Okay, I'm going to do a action that has only been done once, I believe, which is to archive. I'm going to discard five cards. Okay. It wasn't I did it? All of this goes bye bye. Why am I getting rid of so many cards? Because I'm about to pick up a whole. Mike is bunch writing of down cards. the knowledge so that it would not be lost. All right. Hey, I've got four monuments in my past. You do. So I'm going to be drawing three cards plus two. I draw five cards. So basically, that allowed me to draw five cards, or to get to have the same amount of cards as I started, and get rid of all of that broken knowledge. Now I do my little thingy me bobbies here. If I have at least five on my board, discard one. I do, and this comes into my past. And I have five in my past, and Tom, that lightning fast turn is done. It is. It is. I'm almost thrown off by it, mm -hmm. but but I'm not. All right, I'm going to take a tech here, this one here, even though I don't want to get rid of that thing. I do want to draw the card. Not only do I want to draw the card, I actually draw three cards. So I will go. To, I'm actually, I actually gained a point there, so I don't know why I'm whining so much, but... <laughs> So You're going for the Loki strategy, okay? Did I actually draw the cards? I did not. He is so Loki going for that three. strategy. Did I draw? I feel like hey -oh. I feel like I didn't. These are not I already had these. Okay. Oh, that was not what I wanted to get. Okay, well. Ooh. That's interesting. That's less interesting. Okay, so I'm going are to Are we running the timer over there, Roy? I'm going to Take this six technology card. Ah, nuts. I mean, ah, nuts. Sumerian cuneiforms. cuneiforms. Yeah, that was their, like, the precursor to um, hieroglyphs. That's just worth two points in the game. Then I'm done. Ba -ba 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 -ba. I, mmm. Ooh. Okay. How was that? How was that bad? No, no, no you no, took no, something just, he wanted. No, oh. not necessarily. I just, there's so many good choices. Yeah. All right. The choices. The choices. <laughs> Intriguing. I'm going to go ahead and play this one out into my third space of the timeline. One, two, three, quattro. This is the uh, Bora Bodur Temple. Each time, so in, infinitely, while this is out, every time I create an artifact, I can also learn a technology uh, if I meet its requirements. I'm going to create an artifact. This one here, this is kind of cool to show off. Every time I place something in my fifth or sixth space of the timeline, 
I get to remove two knowledge off of cards. Oh, yeah. Genetic disc. I like that one, actually. Okay, so I played that one, uh, which now, because of this one, allows me to learn a technology. I'm going to play, uh, I'm going to take Aristotle over here, which allows me to draw three cards, because I got two, one, two, three, because I got two green or uh, uh, cities mm -hmm. in my past. Decline time. Or sorry, timeline time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Mm -hmm. Yoink. I draw a card. Now, decline phase. Mm -hmm. Okay. You are done? Mm -hmm. Yep. Mm -hmm. All right, Tom, I'm going to be playing this card. I'm ready. At a three. I'm going to put it in my one spot, so I'm discarding three Mike cards to do so. Mike can learn a technology so. by playing this card if he fulfills its requirements. So well, basically, that's only during the decline phase, but I'm, I discarded three cards to put it right there. Wow. Okay. So you want to do it, and then... I want to be able to have access to that, like, for the rest of the game, basically. Wait, what? Uh, because that's a that's a decline phase power. It happens one time when it declines. Oh! That's fine. That's all I was going to say, it's still a good card. It's still good. I, no, I'm still... I have, you're not I, getting 80 technologies no, out of that card. I'm getting 80 technologies <laughs> out of that card. It's going to happen. Um, so I'll place that one for my first action. Let me see if, which ones I'm going to probably take. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay, and then we will for my second axion, do three, four, five. Also, at the end of this round, we're going to be getting new ones of these. So I wonder when the timing of that happens. Three, four, five. No, you will do those as they go into decline, and then we'll flip the board. Okay, I'm just saying. I think we. Uh, I think you just cheated right there. All right, um, and then for my second axion. I'll let you know when I cheat. That's fair. I cheat in people's I'm going to do... Like, watch. I'm just taking a card. See you know, how I like it very loud. <laughs> that's yeah, how you cheat, way. Mike. That is true. I'm taking the deck. When I go to the Vegas casinos, I just reach across and I grab the chip. <laughs> These are mine now. <laughs> yes, because right. the, the guards there will be so stunned. They'll do nothing. <laughs> All right. They'll be like, ah, I guess he can do that. I'm going to take the Earthquake show Engineering, the Tom. Go ahead and... I don't want to show this because that was my next action. That's a shame. Oh. Discard the three cards and draw a card for each discard card. That, that sickens me, Mike, and yes. it irritates me. So I'm, dra uh, I'm so discarding those three. Oh, uh, one. Uh, wait, oh, yeah. Mike does get the tech, I suppose. Yes. Thank you. Remember how you said you cheat out loud? Mm hmm. I do. Yeah. I do. Okay. So um, there was that. No, oh, you're getting ahead of yourself. Do you turn in order because you're looking, I did. I know you're already looking to do that action. Absolutely. But I'm not there yet. I'm just saying I want to at least see what's up there. Don't look ahead. I don't want pre-planning in this game. I want you to think mm, in the moment. No. Um, okay, so uh, I think that was my second action. That's right? awesome that my dad taught me. Yes. Don't save I, for the future, don't plan ahead. I played this, <laughs> I, I took the first that. You meet. You're making it hard for me to do this in order. Okay. <laughs> I've taken my two actions. Now, if I have at least five on my board, discard one. I do. No other things there that let that happen, right? So now, these come off. This comes down here. This says I may learn one technology if I fulfill its requirements, mm -hmm. which I do. Um, I can do this one. But all this allows me to do is take one of these and put it at the bottom of the deck. It doesn't yeah. allow me to take it or anything? Yeah, well, it has yeah, so. Well, that's not that exciting, You're though. stopping someone else from getting it? Like, yeah. I have four blue monuments, you'd stop me from getting the, the five monuments thing. No, I think instead what I'm going to do is I will... If I ever drew another blue... <laughs> Although, that would allow me to draw two more cards. I was about to discard and draw cards. cards, but then Mike... Yeah, I'm going to do this one. Because this is going to allow me to draw two more cards. Because of this... Yeah, you really need cards. I need right, cards. Mike, which board is getting flipped? Are we at that point yet? Wait, well, then you you, no, I first need to do this. Choose a level two technology, put it at the bottom. Which of the is going to clear this out right away. Yeah, sure. So it doesn't matter which one you do. Oh, no, it goes to the bottom of the deck. So yeah. it matters slightly. Uh, slightly. Let's go ahead and do this one. Okay. Yeah, you fool. Good. I don't care. <laughs> I don't know that it matters. I don't, <laughs> I don't think we're right. getting to the bottom of that. Mike, which one's getting flipped? Um, of these, which one's getting flipped? Yeah, one of the Yeah, ones. let's Third go ahead ones. and. No one wants... Yeah, Chris wants this one. Get rid of this one. Tom wanted that one, so stop being a jerk. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so that flips Whoa. now. And now there's lots of these. 
more of a focus on end game scoring technology. Yeah, yeah, which makes sense. Because I'm Ooh. at seven right. cards in my past now. I'm going to play this one here. You fool, so this is you a cool one. The Chinese alphabet. I got some pyramids. <laughs> this is going to give me two points for each set of three different technologies that I have. I already have two full sets, so this is mm -hmm. a minimum of four points. I'm very pleased with this one. So um, pleased with yourself. I, I, I am. I've never been pleased there. <laughs> um, so that's my first action. My second action. I don't like that. I don't like that. Oh, I do like that, though. Don't like that. I don't like that. I do like that. Seven minor is passed. Three or less. Have you had a turn board. yet, Tom? Are you had an action yet? Oh, see, this always happens. What's going this on is one here? Of my, this is Vassal's. This is outrageous, Vassal's Chris. law of, uh, I'm going to do this, reveal the top five cards, so you can just Dang. Yeah, I like take that. It. Take it. Oh, I will. Trust me. I will take one. So you reveal five. You get the first shot. I'm getting two cards for taking that action. That's outrageous. All right. So Tom gets first pick. Each of your opponents must pick. discard an artifact from their board. Okay, that's that's a decline one. If you have five blues in your past, discard seven of your evil technology. Okay. You may discard two know. cards from your hand. If you do, discard up to three from one or several of your monuments. Mm -hmm. Each time you learn a purple, discard one from your monuments and draw a card. Mm -hmm. If you have two monuments in space one, discard one. From any of your monuments and draw a card. Oh, that's kind of tricky. All right. Uh, it's going to be one of these blue ones I'm taking. If you have five in your past, discard three from your board. I don't know if I love that. Well, because you're playing to have them on your board, aren't well, you? Sort of. I mean, at the same time, I don't want negative points. Um, but I will take this one instead. That's the card I took. That's one. The when you learn a Whenever feather. Whenever I learn a purple, yeah. Okay, well, that makes sense. Give me that big rock artifact, that second one there. Yes! Yes! I can't believe this one made it all the way back to me! Well, I, I didn't want it. Um, I wasn't going to take it just to mess you over. I'm not a that. hate drafter. I appreciate that. Um, I'll take this one that makes you guys just get rid of one of your artifacts. That makes sense. Oh, I have oh. seven cards. No! Yeah, yeah. No! It's fine. No! This tablet was an okay early game card. I'm okay mm -hmm. getting rid of it at this point. Yeah. Don't don't try to Don't try this at home. I'm folks. okay, Mike, uh, Tom, if you make Okay, me well now I'm very those. offended. All right. All right, we're set. We're it's set. Me. I'm going to go play I one of these out. I have as close as to your age. <laughs> that is true, yes. I was talking Mike for all the grief I get Mike. I'm like what, Yeah, 4 years younger than him. <laughs> oh, that is true. <laughs> so I guess first there's only one tech here. So there is. Wipes. Sorry. We're going to have to reshuffle, aren't we? I guess you can these run out of text in this. Oh, those are these are also ones. ones? Yeah. Oh, okay. Then we probably won't. Because, again, these down here, Yeah. we do need points at some point. So Mike has seven texts in his thing, or right? Seven, yeah, seven cards so in my path. that's halfway to ending the game. and It's going to speed up here, I think, a little bit. Chris has. will have five at the end of this turn. Mm-hmm. Uh-oh. All right. <laughs> Diggity darn. Uh, so it's the same type. Woo! Well, if I play this one, I can learn a technology I qualify for. Um, I do have... <laughs> so, this is a little bit of a jerk move here. Mm. I'm at 10 cards. You cannot draw above 10, but I'm taking Melchizedek. One, because of his sweet, sweet name. But two, because I am trying to set collect these. So I'm foregoing the ability completely just to set collect. Uh, I don't that's, see how that's a jerk move. No, it's fine. I, mean, I already people... got blues. I don't need blues. I got yeah, blues for sure. days. All right, second action over here. I sing the blues. Mm. Uh, yeah, so my first one was do this. Second action, I'm going to play this one over here. Encore Watt. Oh, sweet. Oh, yeah. Encore Watt is very cool. That's that's like in my, if I could go anywhere, mm -hmm. I would want to go see that. Yeah. That's, one, that's, that's in my top ten things I want to see. So all of my reds uh, come out with one fewer. Uh, this actually has a power that stays in play even after it's in decline. Ye Not decline. Yeah, because it's permanent. See. I yeah. I thought that I thought was that's only, only on your board, board, Tom. Apply this whenever the conditions are met. I think there's a. If that's the case, then I should have been doing this the whole game. Basically, it was like one of the first cards I I got in my past. I shall look it up. All right. So while you do that, because of this technology, or this artifact here, I get to discard 
two knowledge from any monument when I play something in a five or six. So sweet. You're right. Its effects are not available. I lied. Like Once it's in the game. past, yeah. yeah. yeah I lied. Past like Otherwise, it would be a lot to keep track of, too. All right. So now it's my timeline phase. Mm -hmm. I don't have zero one cards in hand. Surprise! Uh, I can draw a card. Well, fine, if I have to. But I'm excited about this. I can discard two cards to get rid of three knowledge. And now that's not an action. That is, I think, what's kind of uh, particularly exciting for me. So I'm going to yoink these two. I'm going to, oh, sorry, yeet. That's what the ancient Sumerians said. I'm going to discard two cards to get rid of three knowledge on my. And now decline time. Michael. You're, you're done. done. Okay, done. fantastic. Fantastic. Had a good turn. Had a good, I'm it's happy a good with turn, my Chris. It's a good turn. All right, let's uh, go ahead and. One, two. Oh, that's pretty good. Should have done those in another order. I could have drawn one more card. <laughs> oh, well. You live, you learn, then you get loves. I learned nothing. You learned nothing. We refuse to learn from our mistakes. That is correct. We are doomed to repeat them, and we're okay with that. I was sitting there thinking about ancient civilizations one day, and I, it's, it's funny that so many cultures have figured out, you yeah. know, beans and rice, complete protein. I'm going to discard three cards to play this Dolmen of Gochang in my f number one spot. How is that thing staying up? I know, right? That's the one that I just drafted from, from, from you, basically. I think I would know about that. I actually don't. Huh. I don't know about that one either. That's really interesting. So you, you discard it extra to shoot it up to, to the shoot front it up of the to the front of my timeline. Yeah, you want it to collapse immediately. You do not build things to last. That's correct. All right, so I've done that. Um, then, yeah, let's go ahead and take this one. It's going to give me three points at the end of the game because I already have those in my past. I'm going to <laughs> soon, soon have a lot more, and I knew you wanted that soon. Um, so that is going to do that. Now, let's trigger stuff. If you have at least five on your board, discard one. Hey, I do. Get rid of that card. You don't get to use it no more. I know. Um, but all of this is going away. I'm going to end up with those. How is it all going away? Because of this. Oh, because of this. Because this is going into decline this turn. Mike, is, Mike has mastered this game. Well, no, I'm still, I could have gotten rid of those three instead no. of taking this, but it was because of you See, that I... It was a so minus one. Broken two social oh. contracts at the table. One Actually, is no. when you're accused of being slow, you then accuse the faster people of also being slow. No. The second is when you're when you're winning, you then say, I'm actually sucking at this, so your no. loss is even well, that much worse. No, I'm saying I did make a bad play there because this is two points. This is actually minus three. Then so. put it back. No. I won't allow you to redo no. it. No, I'm gonna I'm gonna the card laid is a card played. Okay. <laughs> okay. How are you? How does cheat very out loud? <laughs> I will remember this These later. go down a here. Card laid is a card played. <laughs> All right. During discard or during uh, the decline, if you have it, f uh, five of these in your past, which I do, discard seven. Goodbye. Wow, that's great. Does it include itself? I mean, to, it has to, right? To uh, to clarify on timing, you do activate the card first, and then you would take the knowledge. So did that not work? If, I'm not allowed because I don't I was going to say, if it doesn't work, then I would back it up and put another card yeah, in front of fine. it. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, so that was that. Um, nothing else happens. I think that's that. All right, I'm going to put out this. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Cool monument from, wow, this is, I don't know. I'm not sure. That would be a tough These one to These blue pronounce. ones are hard to show. This is from India. Anyway, Kay. I'm playing it. Doesn't really matter. It's a it's a blue screen. It's supposed to go at five. I'm playing it at one. Oh, I should have drawn two cards for that. That's correct. So I've discarded four cards to play that at one instead, and it comes in with the two knowledge. I'm now going to take that. Ah, oh, Mike already took it. Um, <laughs> I guess I'll take this one and draw three cards. And then all this falls into my past. Oh, you drew, well, if it makes you feel better, you drew the one that I was going to just draw. Oh, that makes me feel better. Good. And I'm not kidding. Good. If you had a few tears come out. Of well, it, no, feel, I don't know that I want to quite go to that. I now. feel a little better. Seems I am a little done. dramatic. I mean. All right, Thomas, you're done. 
Uh, yes. All right. I'm finished. My first action, I'm going to play this one out here. Now I have this effect, which means that this comes out with one fewer knowledge on it. I have this effect, which means this one comes out with one fewer knowledge on it. So nothing. I can swap this with another one of my timeline. So I'll do that. Zoop. All right, that's fine. And fortunately, this is a zero point card, but uh, I do need to play some bigger point cards at this point. Um, next up, I'm going to play this, so this one here into this slot number three. I'm going to uh, it's going to come out with four knowledge on it. Bop, bop, bop. This one immediately lets me learn a technology if I can fulfill its requirements. I have this in my past, so I'm going to draw three cards. I'm going to play some insane. Stuff on I like it. I'm excited, Tom. This is this is bad mojo, but but we've stopped caring about our sieve. We have that. I we like have. It. I like it. Uh, I can activate these things now. I have three or less, so I can draw a card. Nine cards in hand, uh, and then I have this one here. So I'm going to discard two of them. Yes. Ah. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, I'm going to discard two of them. To oh, 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 that comment in chat was really funny. Yes. Remove three. Yes. Decline time. I agree, Kabuki. <laughs> That's a safe assumption. Yeah. In decline, decline. Can you decline, show me the card you just played so I can show everyone else? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Sorry. <laughs> this one, which let me grab this technology. You may learn one tech if you fulfill its requirements. Yeah. And then I grabbed Yoink. That one there. I've got those in my past. I drew some cards. I drew some cards. Played this. Activated this one to discard stuff. I'm having a heck of a game. All right. I'm having a heck of a game. So uh, it, it requires one card to play this out, Tom. Uh, I have to discard one, but I'm going to discard an extra two to play it into my two spot instead of my four spot. And one for each monument with a activation in your past. All right. So. I go ahead and place those to put this in two. This comes with notice, three. notice, folks, all scoring happens at the end of the game. There's no scoring right. during the game. So right. that actually saves us a lot of this work. This comes out with three instead of four because of my artifact. So that was my first action there. And then since I have one card in hand, I'm going to go ahead and tap three of these to draw nine more. That's pretty awesome, Mike. I'm not going to lie. That was pretty cool. All right. So I'll draw nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Let's go through the process. I have nothing that's going to be triggering. This goes like this. I'm done. All right, here goes insanity. Let's see. So I'm going to play this card here. This is another one of these push your luck style cards. This has eight on it. And if it has at least one, I'll discard it immediately. So I have to get rid of it. But I'm going to put it in the number one slot with eight on it. Do it. I love it. By discarding two cards. I then I'm going to play a new artifact. That every turn, if I have at least 17 lost knowledge on my board, I can learn a technology. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I'll have like a few turns to do that. But, mm -hmm. but hey, why not? Perfect. So, so I can't do that yet because it hasn't happened yet. That's correct. So that is that. Um, and then whoop! All right, so I now have 21 negative knowledge. <laughs> So I have 21 <laughs> negative points. However, that means my card that says of at least 20 get 12. So I didn't really lose anything. And this card does not come into my timeline because I failed it. Nicely done. Yeah, I don't know if that's going to work, but I have one more trick up my sleeve. All right. Wow, I'm excited about this turn. All right. <laughs> Who else is excited? Nope. nope. I see nothing in the chat. Sorry. <laughs> All right. I have to play them in this order. So first, I'm going to play a fiver out here, but I have to discard two cards to make it work, which I think are, is going to be... Oh, definitely not that one. I think it's going to be these two. Uh, discard, please. So I can bump it over to the number three slot. Now I'm going to play a card at my number two. Or this comes out with nine knowledge, minus one from this relic, minus one from this card. So it's going to have seven knowledge on it. And now, I'm going to play this one out to my two slot, but I'm going to discard another card. Whew. 
Are you following? No, I have no idea. I just have to <laughs> assume he's, uh, he's playing this correctly. All right. Chris, is, his method of cheating is confusion. It's just, yeah, just like, play a bunch of cards. Yeah, I, sure, I, it makes I guess. sense. I'm glory to roaming this, right? So this is the first one that I'm playing here. So now what's going to happen, because I play that first in my three slot, this one second in my three slot, uh, what will happen is every activation, every timeline phase, I'm going to remove two knowledge off of this. So it started with seven. This one here starts with uh, two, minus one, minus one. So this one's clear. Uh... Immediately discard one knowledge from a red card in my timeline. Oh, you know what? That is a good combo. I never thought of that. You were talking about the one adjacent? Mm -hmm. If you can put it in the same slot as that other yes. color, they slide to get... Oh, they do. Yeah. It's Chris nice. figured out the, the killing strategy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I activate uh, everything here. I have three or less, so I draw a card. Yes. <laughs> I can... I don't think I actually want to discard to, to get rid of knowledge right now. Uh, so... I'm going to activate this one. Wait, you still have turns? How many cards did you? I know, it's crazy. I'm, just, I'm doing the timeline activation, so I'm going from six down to four. Oh, you're doing timelines. Yeah, yeah. And so every round that this slides down, it's still adjacent yeah. to those. Yeah, we know. We, so now we got that phase. really clear. Would you like to tell us again? Every round that mm -hmm. this... Like you're up. All right. I'm going to go ahead and play this card, Tom. Where, where, Mike, how many cards do you have in your thing? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, I'm at nine. Or okay. ten. One, two, three, four, five, nine. Nine. Okay. I'll be well, at ten at the end of this. Yeah, turn. we're getting close. That's why I'm yeah, going to yeah, keep yeah. an eye on it. I have All a total right. of like a. Four. I'm playing this <laughs> card, Tom. It's going to allow me to get rid of the three uh, knowledge that are there. So that's a nice little. So this is a one-time shot. Yeah. So I'm actually what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the three from here and just pop them over here, right? Functionally. Equal. So you Functionally basically equal. taught some kids, and then erase the chalkboards. Correct. Then I'm going to play it's a debt strategy. <laughs> this card, which says. Actually, this would come in with one less, I should say, because it normally comes with two. See if what you I'm have saying? three in your pass, this monument comes into play with five less. So I comes in I with one. I would have loved to have drawn that. I don't like the fact that Mike is doing the blue strategy, same as me. So that comes in with one. All right. Those were my two uh, actions. This is going, well, first of all, let's make sure there's anything that triggers. Nothing does. This comes right here. These go right there. And now that is my turn. Now I'm at 10. And I'll be at 12 at the end of my next turn. But oh. I really can't argue much, Mike, because uh, I also have that same card. Basically. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> I'm going to play it one lower, discarding a card. So if I have at least four in my past, this comes to play with six less, so it just has one on it. And then for my second action, I have 15 lost knowledge. Oh, look at you. So the Phoenician alphabet, I can learn it. That's awesome. It's four I points. haven't learned it. It's four points, right? Yep, that's So good. now that I have that, that four plus... That 12 is 16. It's... Yeah. I'm pseudo doing it. Also, when I built this, I draw a card. And then, bloop, 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 bloop. I apologize for taking so long on my turns. Chris. It's all good. I'm going to show off this card. Because well, you've been showing off air all your mm, moves. So I, I'm not, I'm not, I don't think I'm playing this, but I want to just show it off. I'm really debating this. Eight victory points... I could discard to shove it right here in the front, but you have to do, you have to skip your decline. Yeah, phase. but you know it's going to happen next yeah, turn, so I mean, that's worth it. Right. Yeah, but also I want these things to fire off. We yeah, well, I'm, I have I'm, the concern I'm, of Mike. Right, Mike is very close to ending the game. Uh, the it would have to be a l the earliest I could do is two turns. I can't put any more in the ones. Right. You could you could shove stuff in the two. So the but game ends I'm when the fourteenth card goes. I don't want to say this too much because it could dis it could hurt me. But I'm disincentivized from doing that. Yeah, I don't want to say why, but I am. I think what I'm going to do is oh, I didn't two actions. Oh, thank that, you. Sorry. That's kind of important. End game points. Four artifacts, so this one's always takeable. That's a yeah. three points. Oh, wow, yeah. Ten cards in your hand, that's always you, Mike. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> Whoo! Okay, mm -hmm. this one's hard to pass mm -hmm. up. Mm -hmm. So I think I am just going to take Emotep here. Four artifacts, that's three yeah, points. Yeah, if you hadn't have, I would have. Yeah. Emotep! Emotep! I think I'm going to do a, a bold move here. Make a bold move. Carl. I watched The Mummy a few weeks ago. It's oh, crap. did you? It holds up cards. well. I I watched the Tom Cruise Mummy once, uh, and the Brandon Fraser one holds up well. All right. I'm going to uh, I'm gonna try it. So this you make this with, sound terrible. That's I a know. really good card. We're not feeling bad for you at here. all. It, it's pretty great. So it comes with two fewer <laughs> knowledge because of this one, and, or sorry, this one and this one here. So yoink. I have to discard two cards to shove it over into my number one column. 
which I will, but I'm giving up a great card. One of those that scores for sets oh, of boy. technologies. Oh, I wish I could get this card, Chris, because I have th I'm gonna have three sets for I, sure. I know, right? But there you go. So timeline activation phase. This one is still adjacent to let me explain this one again. It's still adjacent to two. <laughs> <laughs> Mike, you can start going. It's I can forever to decline. All right, all right. I can draw a card. Oh, because I have zero one cards, I have three or less, I can draw a card. Oh, I could still discard. <laughs> he's, he's chasing this is, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is getting this is getting nutty here. Which I will. So one, two, three. And now I'm gonna decline everything. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh no no sorry. Oh my goodness. I, I'm skipping the decline phase, right? Yes. You are skipping the decline phase. So all right, my mistake. I have seven monuments in my past. I have three or less broken knowledge on my you board. You do take it. I will. All right. Um, I could also just take that for three points. Well, why wouldn't you? Well, because I kind of, if I leave these here, then that's also three points. See what I'm got saying? It. I don't. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and discard these. You, you sure don't. You got to get 20, rid of these. Twenty-one lost knowledge. We throw all our books in the trash every year. All right, that there. The great we don't fire cover the library file of Alexandria. By the way, it's we're going to we're gonna put that to shame. Something I do my ten top ten least favorite memories of being a kid. One was putting stupid contact paper on the books to protect them. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Did you have to do that? Yes. Yeah. And then you got someone else's old book from a previous year, mm -hmm. and some kids treated it well, and many did not. It is your turn, sir. And occasionally you might get blamed for. All righty, I'm going to do a pretty simple turn, as all my turns are. Um, I'm going to turn these three to draw six. I better turn four to draw eight. I can't draw eight, so I'll just draw seven. I'm going to draw two more and I'm, after I shuffle this, but I did all that so I can take the ten, ten cards card in one. my hand. Sure. Bloop, bloop, bloop. That wipes. Oops, sorry, sorry. So I'll shuffle this and then I'll, and you can go, Chris. Oh, and then my decline. Ah! Mr. Bill over there is going into decline. Um. I'm just a sieve. A lowly, lowly sieve. Eight. I need two more cards. I only have two endgame scoring ones. I should keep track of how many cards I have in decline because that matters. Uh, no, it doesn't. <laughs> 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 I have. Um, I only have eight cards in decline compared to y'all. I know. All right. Um, after you shuffle, I'm going to draw cards as well. But I'm. I'll draw cards first. And you know what? What the hell? I'll do uh, eight of them. Sorry for this obnoxious roadblock. Mm -hmm. It's my turn. Mm -hmm. How many? Uh, eight, please. Is this your first or second action? First action, yeah. So Boo! I, Boo! I archived those. Let's see what I got here. Uh, and then I think... Mm -hmm. Oh, it's great. I'm just going to take this one as my second action. Uh, emerald tablet. That's worth two points. Mike, you're up. All right, I'm going to, um, oh, crap. Do you guys mind? I forgot to take the free tech that I could have gotten. Yeah, if you can get one, sure. Oh, yeah. sure. I could have taken one of these top ones. Mm -hmm. um, you no. This was also out. No, I would have done that one. Okay. Just because I think that's fun. And so I then we refill this, right? Yeah. So that, that wouldn't have been there. Oh, no, no. Yeah, we refilled now. Now after my turn, yeah. Yeah. What was that? You had, uh, if you had at least nine, nine on my board, I do. Okay. So I've now recovered 18 of that 20. That's so pretty So I'm feeling slick. pretty good. Yeah, but I don't know if I have enough other points. I'm just, I'm evening out. Right. Yeah, yeah. Just like life. Remember that card that you said you weren't going to hold on to from the start of the game? What was that card? I don't remember. If you have 20 on your board, trash 15 of them off of it. Hmm. Huh. I can play those cards in any order. Could I play it and take the 12 points and then trash 15? I don't know. I'd have to look that up. Like, those cards are worth the points, right? Yeah. This is where my... Yeah. I'm hoping to get a lot of points from tech. If Chris Who's, wasn't doing so I'm much sorry, tech, I, you, It, you it know, is my turn. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Well, no, no. I'm sorry. <laughs> I've been going much... The record will show. All right. I'm going to play this. It's going to come in with one less knowledge. I'm going to discard three to put it in my one spot. So it's coming in with 13. 
Hey, Roy, can we turn off the green screen briefly? I want to show some of these cards in their full glory. I'm, I, I did forget to decline. Okay. Right. That didn't yeah. actually full gloryize it, but yeah. So. so will there be... I think you can leave that there, Roy, right now. I don't I'm just going to put have, lots of cards there and show people cards. All right. I'm going to start showing people cards from my hand. I'm only at eight. You were tearing it up. Okay, so this comes in with 13. All right. So it came in with 13. Oh, you mean like this? And then it says immediately. Yeah, that uh, works really well. We need a little. Um... It's fine. <laughs> yeah. So when this card came into play, you, you may discard as many artifacts from your board as you wish. Discard or discard four from this monument for each one. So I'm going to get rid of all three of these. Holy oh, <gasps> smokes! Mike, you're you're wiping out all your artifacts. So you're destroying comes, your sieve. That got rid of with twelve. Thirteen. Right. And I got rid of twelve. That's awesome. It's an eight-point card, right? It's a seven-point card now, unless I wanted. Wait, was that my? F that was my first action. I could even discard this to get rid of that if I wanted to. Yeah, you can show. Or, or instead, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to put this right here with four knowledge on it, and it says discard one. In a moment, it will discard one from any other monument. That goes away. This comes here. This moves down here. All right, so I'm at 13, I believe. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Yes. Thomas, it's you. All right, I'm going to pay, um, I'm going to put this in my one, number one slot, and it cost me two cards to do that. And then this has six on it, and if it has any, discard it immediately. But for my second action, I'm just going to discard. One, two, three, four, five, six. From to get them all off, so they're all off of that. Yep. And so, whoa, 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 it falls in. Over to you, Chris. Okay. This, this Where are you so at, Mike? I need to keep. I'm at numbers. thirteen. Thirteen. Yeah, but I have no cards in hand. Yeah, but you could. I could cards, theoretic. Cards. I could end it. Maybe <laughs> I could. I'm not. I'll tell you right now. I think that's very unlikely unless something Two, changes. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. Okay, no, you're not close either. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try this. I'm gonna play this out to my two, but it's actually my three by you discarding. You a card. can't play it to your two because you only have two in each spot. Yeah, but he's discarding a card. He's actually playing it to I'm the three. I'm bumping it over. Oh, I see. I got gotcha. you. You're going opposite direction. I see. Yoink! So I'm doing that. This is gonna come out with three knowledge on it. One, two, three. Immediately choose two technologies and put them on the bottom of the respective decks. Um, okay, well, I'm telling you, I'm probably ending the game now. <laughs> see. I'm sorry. Uh, wait a minute, is that the one? No, no, you're fine. I'm not. That's not the one I'm worried about. It's going to go away. Bottom no, of the that's respective. not the one I'm worried about. Oh, that's hilarious. There's one, <laughs> There's one card in the, in the deck. So they just... Burp, burp, burp. You've done nothing. I... Nothing. In fact, I just got rid of the one tech that I almost sort of kind of wanted. Hilarious. But more importantly, I'm playing this one out here into the three. It starts with 10 minus 2, so 8. Mm -hmm. And then ding, ding, ding. And now, uh, during the timeline activation, this is adjacent to two greens, so I get to discard three off of here. Uh, nothing else there. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Yep. So, I'm good there. I still get to draw a card. I'm. We're still aghast one. over here that yeah. Mike destroyed his sieve. Well, it's, it is what it is. He burned everything down. I can see Chris ending this game instead of me. Where are you at, 10 now? Oh, I am at 10. All right. This is the one. If this had gone away, I would have ended the game. Because I do have seven. Out of spite. No, no, because <laughs> I would have been incentivized to. Uh, so, seven <laughs> monuments of the same type. Three monuments with one of those in my past. I may have one, two, three. I do have that as well. Do I just start snagging up points? Yeah, why, why would not? You? There's three more. Okay, that's my turn. Ooh, this goes little down. Little Pythagoras. He loves squares. Mm -hmm. Hmm. I... Do I want four points or two? I guess four points makes Why more sense. Why wouldn't you? Yeah. 
I know. I'm just walking through my head here. Mm -hmm. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I can't take that one. But I do have five blues. Yeah, so I would have taken it if you one. hadn't. We're going to run out of text soon. And I'm just going to draw four cards. Two, three, four. Go ahead, Chris. Okay. <sighs> yeah. So I'm taking play. So what happens the at this point? Uh, I guess when we run out of text, we run out of text. Right, but do these Learn. come out? Oh, yeah, yeah. So this immediately and discards. Yeah, okay. It says if there's not enough cards left to refill the tile, put the cards and the tile back in the box instead. Whoa. So, so that's it, right? Well, well this we can is still a discard pile. We can still do it, but oh. it's almost it. So I've been working on the railroad all the live long day. Mm -hmm. That's good. This one's better. I have 10 monuments in my past. So I took two of these. That's really going to boost these endgame scoring cards. Now I go through my, uh, my activation here. So this one is going to reduce down to two. Hmm. Yeah, I think Chris could end this before I do. That's interesting. Yeah, it might. Happen. It depends on what I do. I mean, like I could, I could guarantee it and end it on this turn if I wanted to. Oh. By drawing ten cards and then playing Shutting one and having it, playing it into the one right spot. Away, yeah. I'm gonna get rid of three of these, and now I decline. Have you, have you played with Chris before? I think I tell you the truth. He's gonna do it in his next turn, so I think it behooves me to, to end it. Probably end it now, right? Because, because otherwise, the only thing because then he doesn't he loses eight. Right. Well, yeah. four points. All right. So I'm gonna. This is seven. Points on this card right there. But I subtracted five. So I'm gonna, Four, I mean. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just tap if five of these. Turn, one, two. Oh, <laughs> do it! <laughs> I'm gonna tap five of these to draw ten. Okay. Right. And since Mike is last, we wouldn't get another turn if yeah, he ends this will it. Straight up in but the he room. might not take it depending on how many points. It depends on he what I draw. He has to get one here. that has no. He would rather not tank his score. Right. But yeah, there are some. There are some that are very low that have one or zero. Right. Yeah. I'm good either way, because my hand is full of trash. <laughs> but I'll just start grabbing the left, the rest of the text. I tell you, I would love one more turn. Yeah, <laughs> I'm sorry. You're not. You're, you're not getting it. I'm. I'm sorry. I have to tell you. Hint. You, you are. You are not getting it. Um, no, I. I absolutely figured not, Mike. Yeah. Okay. So. So here's well, Mike's what, deciding what to do here. Mm -hmm. We're going to get points from all the monuments that we have that made it off. Mm -hmm. There's a pen right over under there. Are we going to use the score sheet? We, we can. And then we'll get points for all the techs. And then we'll get points for um, whatever that circle is. I'll look that up. And then we'll lose points for this knowledge here. Do, do these ones? Roy, can you throw me a pen? Oh, where's the pen you said? Uh, it's right under the rule book. Oh. Thank you, Roy. And These ones uh, don't count at the end of the game, right? I don't think so. I'll look it up in a second. Okay. This is always, folks, when I'm playing in a game, I'm like, Tom, Mike, Jerk. how do you spell your name? Is what you say when you don't know someone's name. Oh, my God. That, that you've played the entire game with, and it didn't matter because you can get away without calling someone their name until it's time to write it on the score pad. <laughs> you all are going to absolutely hate me. Well, we already do, so I'm not sure anything. If I had a better idea, I think Chris is crushing it, so I have to play this. I have to. I, again, I don't know what you're... What you're going to find out right here. It's not going to affect you, Tom. It's only going to affect Chris. Oh, then I, that's, I was like, I have nothing I, it, I only am doing this because I think you are clearly in the winning position Sure. Here. No, no, go for so it. He just made you lose six points. No, three. Three. Well, it depends. Oh, three. It depends if these... Uh, it depends if these points count at the end of the game or if they get discarded. Oh, they may not they may not affect you at all. That's true. Oh, that's true. That's true. That's so, Mike, we'll look no one hates up, you. But play what's best for yourself. Yeah, okay. So, I'll so if you can drag me down. <laughs> I, I, yeah, I would have almost half to. Final scoring. Count the victory points visible in the color band for each monument in your past. Add He's actually going to get, monument get card points effects. for cards in your... Add victory points for each of your level 2 technologies. Add one for each monument left in your timeline. The points, so you still get you're still going to get a point for each of those. Yes, right. but that does not count that knowledge. Okay, so you're fine. Okay. So I'll go ahead and play those there. So, but it still gives me a point. I think that's still my best bet. None of these would give me more than a point. So you're discarding. I discarded two to play two. it there. All right, well, it why comes in with four, but I'm going to discard four to get rid of those four. Do you have a second action? I do. That was the first action I did. No, your first action was drawing cards. <gasps> I don't have those. I, oh my goodness. That's negative three points. We're on video. I know. Well, no, I know. 
I, I gosh, I think I have to end it. Otherwise, Chris is going to crush. All right. So I'll, I'll end up. I'll have to take those minus four points. Unfortunately, that sucks. Oh, then why am I discarding? There's no reason to discard. Okay, so anyway, first round count points on monuments. Well, give not, me a second. Let me make the, sure I'm doing everything right. Not the bonuses. He's come here. This comes here. Just okay. the just the straight points. So what are we doing on so the just the straight points? Don't count any bonuses on right, the cards right, right, themselves. Right, right, just right. the straight points on these. Yes. Not on our techs. And not the not the ones on the bottom. Because some cards, so folks, you'll see this card here, yeah. shows that this is right, endgame right. scoring. Yeah. No, I'm at 27, Tom. 27. I have 21. 20. And 20. But now the bonuses. The bonuses on these cards. On, the, on these cards. So I have three, for example, which is six. How would 18, you play this? Does it count for itself? 20, 20, 21. For each monument, yes. Okay. Because it has its own. I have 24 activation. bonus points. Don't get too excited oh about gosh. that because that's 12 of those are from having the negative 22 over here. <laughs> I have five. I have five. So my my bonus for this is 14. Though. Oh, my gosh. Oh wait, mine... Did I miss that one? Oh, that's a good one. Hang on. I just threw these in here. Did I miss that one? Three. Three. What was that? And I have 10. Maybe I shouldn't throw my cards. Oh, they're right here. Next to me. <laughs> Two for each one. I did forget that one. Two, four, six. Six more. I have 30 bonus points. Oh, my God. How many? Well, yes, but 10. Minus 22, Mike. Oh, okay. 10 and how many? 14. 14. All right. Bonuses from Tex. So all of the points or just the bonuses? Or just the points out of I here. think they're just points. I don't yeah, think I don't think I, I think don't think they're right. anything else. Thirteen for me. Thirteen? Nine for me. Nine. And I got two, six, ten, twelve, fourteen. Wow. And then one point for each monument still on your timeline. So one. two for Chris and one for Mike. And then negative points. Minus 22. <laughs> seven for me. Minus seven. Two. And this minus two. This is going to be interesting. I, I, this, this is fun. I don't have any idea where this, we're at here. Yeah. Hey, I scored higher than last time. Yeah. Mostly because I left halfway through You did the leave game. early, yes. <laughs> halfway. Right. Not almost. Do the dramatic reveal. Oh, no, we can't do the dramatic reveal on the, on the blue screen. That's okay. All right. We're trusting Tom's 30, 30, mathematical 30, 30, 30, skills here. I know. He's not using a calculator. <gasps> he told us that he blatantly cheats. Before you give us the final scores, Tom. Oh, hang on. I need to recount these because it's that do. close. I wanted to see what the spread between first and third was. I do always like that. Yeah. You know, when, it's, when it's a fun, tight kind of yeah, yeah. tight pack. I feel like this is a game where we went in so many different directions, too. Like, we were doing different things. Guys, there is no first, second, and third. There's only first and tie for second. Are you serious? Wow. It's 43, 43, 44. Whoa. That's crazy. All right. And you got it. Woo! I, that, so ending it was the right call. So, that I was mean, so awesome. close. Here, what, what is that? People can check my math later on. I mean. That's amazing. Um, so I got 51, 61, 65. Wow. But then I subtract 22 and went down to 43. Mike got 37, 47, 50, 51. Minus 7 is 44. Yep. Chris has wow. 34, 43, 45. Minus 2 is 43. Wow. That is super close. That's amazing. That is so yeah. My strategy, I'm happy. I was a little worried that I might fall very far behind. No, no. If I had not taken one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling oh, you, that's So amazing. what if there had been a tiebreaker? Well, we know this because Chris and I actually tied, didn't we, in the last one? Whoever has fewer, oh, I'm not winning any tiebreakers. Yeah, fewer, <laughs> fewer negative points. So, so Chris, Chris would have won, won on the tiebreaker there. Yeah. 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 All right, you folks. not letting me score this. That yeah, was I, that was the only thing. I, that's the only chance I had. Well, folks, hopefully that gives you an idea of how ancient knowledge plays. It can play um, up to four players. You can play mm -hmm. down to two. There's going to be, we didn't even, this is how many cards you didn't see. Yeah, um, right. So there's lots of other cards in the game. There you go. Congratulations to Mike. Thank you. You guys, you were kept, kept. You it. ended the game. It was the right move to I, make. It was, but I, yeah, I, I couldn't math it out. I just intuitively thought it was a way to go. The people of, of Purple Topia. <laughs> Purple Topia yeah. rises again. Yeah, but they have nothing left. They, they, yeah, they because I basically libraries. just, yeah, just eviscerated everything. Anyway, until next time, I'm Tom Vassell. I'm Chris Yee. I'm Mike Delicio. We'll see you next time.